Hi, beautiful. We created these magical looks for you to try out. Card number one, the magician. Let's get started. Fantasy looks. Break out a lightweight concealer to even out the skin tone under the eyes and around the corners of your mouth. Uh, let's do this one and see how this goes. This is already getting off to a bad start. I just realized when I do my makeup, I'm always like, that's not a cute face at all. Oh no, wait. This is way too much, isn't it? Dang it. Oh, this is so much. It's magical. <laughs> oh, this is a disaster. Highlight under your brows with a nude eyeshadow that's a shade lighter than your skin tone. Yeah, this is it. Here we go. From there, apply a metallic purple color on your lids. Okay, this is about to get magical. This is where the magic comes in. I like this one. It's very, like, sparkly. Okay. Ooh. Glitter. Love it. Moving on. Once you're done, find your favorite liner to create an intense liner look. Challenge accepted. You should be able to create a shapely wing. Okay. Ooh. Okay. It's so close to my eye. Oh. That's a big black spot. That is a big black spot. I might just burst into tears at any moment because it's going to poke a tear duct and tears are going to flow. Well, actually, this side turned out better than this side. Good. Moving on, time to find a maroon shade. Use this color to smoke out your lash line area. So many brushes. Uh, this one. Well, it just looks like I have pink eye. This is not good. Yeah. All right. Smoke it out. Now it just looks like I'm tired or I have black eyes. Take a small brush and add a rose gold color along your inner corner. Ooh, I like. Ooh, magical. It's too much. Oh. Oh, something's in my eye. Oh, I just smeared it. Oh well. To finish off the eyes, prep your lashes with a lash curler to perk them up. Uh, not the lash curler again. Mm. Looks like a torture device. It probably is a torture device. I'm getting the hang of this. Oh, okay. And apply a few coats of your favorite mascara. Don't blink while you're applying mascara. I don't like this feeling. I really don't. I'm being honest. Mascara might be the easiest part. Not as cool as Michelle, but that looks cool. Self-esteem, way up. For the finishing touch to illuminate the face, use a highlighting powder. My cheeks are blinging. Hold still, darling. Mm -hmm. To contour, I choose a neutral bronzer to give a hint of definition without being too harsh. Bronze statue of Apollo. I cannot contour to save my life. <sighs> it just makes me look like I have a beard. Cool cheekbone structure. Add a deeper bronzer along your forehead and jawline. That, that is not right. This is fun. I actually feel like I kind of have this down. <laughs> I feel like my face is a million different colors now. Yes, I think I look better now. Finish off your look by filling in your lips with a natural lip liner. Okay, she wants me to make my lips bigger. They're big already, so. Give that perfect lip going. Oh no. And top it off with a high opacity lip gloss. Pro. Do I just kind of like, Whoa. no I don't, because then I smear it on my face. I think that, oh, it's all on my teeth. This wasn't a complete tragedy until now. It's so easy to apply, right? Add a touch of shimmering loose powder on the center of your lower lip. Uh, and we're gonna dab. Uh, gonna... Oh, it's on my tooth. I just feel like I have glitter on my lips, but that's fine. I think we're about as good as we're gonna get. Which is pretty freaking good. Stay magical, and of course, good luck. We love you. If I can do this look, anyone can do it. When I go to an event where I don't want to drink or eat anything, I would definitely wear this. I feel like I have magical powers. It's really empowering. It's great. I love it. Wish I did it a little better.